So here we are over the dam. The water's dropped. It's pretty green. Dog's not fast. Rightio. So I'm gonna have to turn in the surface. Uh, it's below the surface. Anyway, on today's walk I found something interesting. This stump here is where the cormorants come and sit. Now a cormorant is, uh, they're also known as shags. Anyway, while I, when I was going to um, school down at Lakes Entrance, which was uh, one of the many times I'd gone back and re-educated myself, one of our fellow students and uh, someone who became a friend and where she lived on the lake they had these trees and what stumped are dead trees like this and um, the cormans used to come and rest there and scientists used to come and go through their poo looking for those things. Have a guess what it is. It's an ear. It's in part of the inner ear of a fish. So they were dating these fish of specimens from these comments. See, there's a, another one. There's another one. It's bigger, so therefore it must be older. So I was quite fascinated by that. So, there's some weird jobs out there, people. Um, you wonder what, how you could use that in the real world, I suppose you could get a job at a fish restaurant and tell people how old the fish are and uh, what not. And that also comes, so, yeah. You know, I was just looking at a uh, report from, we need a uh, rescue duck. I, hello duck, what's going on? Do you need rescuing? Just read a report where they were saying that Brumbies in the Kosciuszko National Park that the government has estimated in between 12 and 22,000. Private organisation has done a survey using helicopters, infrared and spotting and they've come up with a tenth of the lower number. So, people... Don't always believe the science. You are the science. Don't be afraid to question things. Anyway, enjoy your day. Isn't that fantastic? Go all the way around. Oh, look at Mount Wills up there. Fantastic. Look after yourselves, people. Have a good week.